A report into Afghanistan's biggest financial scandal, which prompted the collapse of the Kabul Bank two years ago, has blamed politicians and bankers, as well as law enforcers and international monitors for failing to investigate properly. The government-backed inquiry is seen as a crucial test of the country's ability to manage its own finances. $935 million have been lost through loan book scheme. Additional $66.2 million were lost through other forms, so-called non-loan disbursement. Afghan government has to spend, had to spend $825 million to save the bank when it was guaranteeing for the deposits. The chief investigator has vowed to put perpetrators of the fraud behind bars. Those implicated include several among the country's elite, including top bankers and politicians. The scandal forced the government to bail out the bank and relaunch it under a different name.